Okay, this is the Dummies Guide to the Big Bertha Alpha 815 driver from Callaway. For technical information or technical specs, you can visit Callaway and review the videos and information they have there. If you're like me, you're the weekend golfer, you like to go out and have a good time, you're looking for a club that's going to improve your swing or maybe give you some more distance, and you need the uh, Dummies Guide to how to make the adjustments. So I'm going to make this easy for you. You can see here this is the Big Bertha Alpha. It has the gravity core. This is adjustable and I'll show you how to do this in a minute. Now what you see here also are two weights that change the way the club swings a little bit. One of these is a 7 gram and the other one is a 1 gram. These are interchangeable. If you want the weight in the heel of the club, put the 7 gram in the heel of the club. If you want the weight in the toe of the club, simply unscrew both of these and simply switch them and screw them back in. That way you're moving the, the 7 gram weight to the, to the location that you want it. Now why do you want it in the toe versus having it in the heel? Good question. I recommend you go to Callaway and see if you can find the answer. The gravity core. The gravity core is actually a rod that comes out and one of in the end of the rod is weighted and you simply turn the rod over. What happens when you turn that rod over it changes where the weight is in the club head. The weight is going to end up in the bottom of the club head or it's going to end up higher in the club head. If the weight is higher in the club head, it causes more ball spin. If the weight is lower in the club, it reduces ball spin. Also has the added benefit of putting additional weight in the bottom of the club. Hopefully that will give you a little bit more accuracy when hitting the ball. So if you're having trouble hitting it or you're getting too much ball spin, move the weight to the bottom. I'm going to show you how that happens.